Bless, O Lord, these rings. Bless him who gives and blesses her who wears, that they may live together in love and harmony through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. ceremony signifies the great union which is between Christ and his church. Christ beautified this ceremony with his presence during the wedding celebration at Cana of Galilee where he performed the first miracle and St. Paul commended marriage as a sacred institution which all persons should embrace and therefore is not to be entered into lightly but to be taken seriously, realizing that this ceremony is ordained of God. Into the holy estate, these two persons come now to be joined as one. I choose to love you in seasons of sunlight and storms. I choose to love you in moments now and to come, and all the times we will have to remind ourselves of why we chose each other. I love you and choose you always. I just want to say you're an amazing woman. You're smart, sexy, intelligent, ambitious, family-oriented, and motivated. I am privileged to call you my wife. I'll continue to love you, respect you, care for you, and adore you. Last but not least, I'll continue to be your biggest cheerleader in all your endeavors. May God continue to bless us.
So cherish those moments, cherish those holidays, cherish all that you can with each other and embrace each other's families. Find a way to say yes. Always keep God first. Advice to y'all, I would just say, make sure you um, keep an open communication. Just stay um, talking, talking about problems, talking over things, making decisions together and all of that. I am just happy and grateful to be here for you and I'm happy to see you smiling. And um, Amanda, you have a big smile on your face. I know he's doing something right. <laughs> Carlos, you got a wonderful woman. And one thing I can say, enjoy each other to the fullest.